Hey everybody, I curious here. Welcome back to the long dark. Here we are. Mystery Lake. Can't, um, Trapper Homestead, not camp office. And uh, I think we're about ready to set out. We got a nice full belly. R well rested. As long as the weather looks good. It looks pretty good. I think we're ready to set out. So, let's go ahead and see if we can make it over to the cave here. At uh, Forlorn Muskeg. The other cave. See if we can find something worthwhile as far as uh, coal. Hopefully we find a whole bunch of it. Because the last cave we went to was amazing. I don't think I've ever had that much coal in a cave before. I was pretty happy to see that. Alright. Weather is good, but still gets us cold pretty quick, unfortunately. You guys are doing good. I'm doing pretty good. Got a new monitor. Uh, so I'm getting used to that. It's the, uh, the Alienware 34-inch wide, ultra-wide uh, OLED. Monitor. Best Buy had it on. Pretty good. Pretty good price. It was $7.99. So, not too bad. So I went from basically having, having uh, two monitors, one horizontal, one vertical, to uh, one monitor. And uh, so far, not, not regretting it. It's a lot cleaner. Can't feel my hands. Plus the... Uh, the black levels in this are just amazing. Never messed around with an OLED before, but it's truly, truly amazing. So, other than that, not really much going on. Just got back from Puerto Rico, and uh, yeah, trip went well. I think I already did. I think I did one video since then, since I've been back. But uh, damn, yeah, freezing. Still uh, getting back into the swing of things from that. Trying to, trying to adjust. Been back to work, though. And, uh, not much to report there. Let's see if there's a wolf here now or no. Uh, I just want to go and get the flare out just in case we come nose to nose with him. There, yep, there he is. But he's going the correct direction for us, so we're going to take advantage of that and move with purpose here. All right, very good. Let's head over here. Hopefully this weather holds off, or holds holds out for us. It's not, not too hateful at all. I'm gonna try to hustle to get there within this weather window, because these things seem to be uh, less and less guaranteed. Kinda wanna go this way. I think we're gonna go this way this time. It's sort of an adventure here because I'm not used to going this way. But the cave I want to go to is in this corner of the map of this region. So kind of just want to head this way and see what we can find. I know there's a way to get up to a radio tower up there, but I'm not going to mess with that. There's a wolf right there. We'll get low. Hopefully we don't ping him. Okay, he's hollering at his friends. This is why I normally don't travel this way. It's because of this wolf here. They're almost guaranteed. Seems like. Just wait for my bones to crack and alert him. Let's we'll stay up high here, though. Okay, he's walking away, so I'm going to move. Hopefully there's not another one over here. Okay, good. I'm gonna move down towards the open area a little bit. Peek down this way. Okay, so far so good. It looks like we've got a sapling of some kind up here. Grab a stick while we have the chance.
There's the tower. There's another tower. It's a different one. In case you're wondering. I'll get low. I don't know if it matters. Is that a sapling or... No, that, yeah, that's a sapling. Say that's a sapling or a... Uh, cattail. I couldn't tell at first from that particular angle, but... Alright, well... The weather seems to be holding out for us pretty pretty well. I mean, we're already freezing, so... But the birch sapling will definitely take time to grab this real quick. Nice. Take it. Right, let's move with a little purpose out the open area here. Grab better... Sight lines. Yeah, I think I'm going to stick to this side here. Up against these rocks. Can't remember if it's worth going up there or not. I don't remember what's up there. I know we had to go up there for the... Uh... Oh, there's another sapling. That looks like a maple. As good as things are going, I might run over there and grab that. Yeah, I'm going to gra grab that real quick. This is right here. Oh. Let's not do... Let's not do that too often. Yeah, we're kind of coming in the same way I would have had I gone around. So I guess six to one half, half a dozen of the other. I'm going to go that way, though, because my cave's over there. Maple, nice. All right, grab a few of these cattails while we're standing right here, and there's like four, four of them. Make that five. This place has so many cattails. Gotta love that. What's this? Oh, a shelter. Firewood, we'll take that. Some mittens, uh, we don't really need those. Pe peaches, which are ruined. I think I can eat those. Another pry bar that's at 100%. This. What's mine at? Uh, we'll go tools. Mine's at 100% still, so I'll just keep what I got. Alright. What happened to that? owner of that shelter. Okay, so... I think it's back in here somewhere. I think there's a wolf over that way. Some, oh, yep, yeah, somewhere over there. I'm gonna keep, have to stay on my toes a little bit here. Move over this way. Can't remember exactly where the cave is. I'm pretty sure it's back in here. In here a few times. Another sapling. Another birch sapling. Well, it was worth it just for the sapling so far. We will need to recover a little bit of our condition. So, so we're not very tired. I don't really have any interest to go into the homestead at this point. There's always coal there, but you need coal for the homestead, so why take it away and then have to bring it back again? So... The only thing I would find out is basically if they had a heavy hammer there or not, and I need to lug one over. That's about all I would find out. Um, so. Let's take a peek this way. See if I can find this cave. Right here somewhere. Oh, another sapling right in front of me, too. I wasn't even seeing it. I was so busy looking for the cave. Another maple. Peek up here. With the new setup, I had to move my mic around a little bit, um, and I uh, disconnected my hardwired. Uh, let's see back here. My hardwired uh, headphones that normally plug into the mic. So I'm using earbuds right now. And I gotta say that directional sound isn't quite as good. Normally I can pinpoint those wolf calls pretty well, but from this direction I gotta say, a little bit less than ideal. I'm just nervous I'm getting close to this wolf. I 
cave. Oh, there it is. That looks like the cave entrance. Let's get inside. Let's get warmed up, folks. Nice. Oh, uh, look. Coal all over the place. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to... With the new OLED monitor, I can definitely see really well in here, but I'm going to go ahead and light it up for you guys. So, let's see. Where was that coal at? Or was that just like... That was a teaser, wasn't it? I don't see any coal in here. Okay. It's probably further back a little bit. We'll grab some sticks while we're here, too. In case we need to extend a fire out with some coal. Do we have any coal here? Those are not coal. Those are just regular rocks. Normally I can spot them really easily and differentiate them. Wow. Yeah. Branches? Okay, what about, is that a limb I can dust up? Right there? Can I break that one up? Oh, I can. Okay, we might do that. Might be worth doing. It's inside, warm. We'll take, take advantage of that on our way back out before we leave. What's it called? Is it called Spence Homestead? Is that what it's called? trying to remember too much stuff to carry the forge over here already weighed it down I guess I did pick up a couple pieces of wood already so there is that what we got back here oh we got a bed back here we don't even have to have our own bed check that out that's awesome but we have the bare bedroll the nice thing is we could sleep in that and not have to cause undue deterioration to the bear bedroll. All right, is there are you, one piece of coal? Seriously, that's it? Oh no, it <laughs> came all this way just for one piece of coal. Oh man, that's okay. We got some saplings. That's that's good. Um, I think what I'll do here is I'm just gonna lay in this bed and warm up. It's really nice out, but I still, it's too cold for me to get moving again, and I need to increase my health a little bit. All right, let's go and turn this off. How do I want to do this? That's the question. I think I just want to warm up. Yeah, I'm not, not tired enough to get full benefit from a tea or anything. So, let's just drink and sleep for a couple hours. We're not going to get much health back, but we'll get a little bit back. And then I say we head on back to Mystery Lake. I have no interest in going to the forge right now. Yeah. I mean, I'll bring my own heavy hammer next time. Um, there's a couple of wolves along the way, and the weather, as temperamental as, as it is, I don't want to get caught there because it's open, and I'd have to burn a significant amount of wood and coal to uh, to stay warm if it, if it gets really nasty, like negative 50. Uh, and that would sort of be with only finding one piece of coal here and probably there's probably four or five pieces there that would basically be uh, we'd be running a deficit then at that point so I think I'm going to steer clear there I don't think the gains are worth the risk so we'll head back to Mystery Lake and then we'll figure out where we want to go from there maybe do another bear hunt alright hours of sleep let's get a drink first Hopefully we don't walk out into a blizzard right now. And since I'm not super tired, if I have a blizzard, I actually want to be able to sleep for a lengthy amount of time. So I'm going to rest this time. Because I, if I rest and I get a little fatigued, I'm okay walking back to Mystery Lake. That won't be an issue. But if I get snowed in here with a blizzard, I want to have my fatigue as low as possible so I can get a, a significant amount of rest. That's worth something. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. We'll just pass, like, uh, let's pass an hour. See where we're at. Okay, we're good. Let's go ahead and get moving here. Oh, I'm going to turn this on for you guys again. Maybe I'll see a piece of coal that I missed on the way out. Oh, and I also wanted to chop up that wood, too. So, let's not forget to do that. That's our weight out anyway. It's real close to 30 kilograms. Okay, so let's 
Let's turn this off here. Let's chop this thing up. It's gonna take an hour. There we go. Drop that tinder plug. This pack is getting kind of heavy. There it is. Two of them. Well, we're coming back with a decent amount of wood, so that's okay. What, what's that now? Thirty-two. Okay. There we go. All right. Keep your eyes peeled for any extra pieces of coal. The other option is to go over to Milton and uh, go into that cave that, has, that goes over to Hush River Valley. Get coal there. I might do that. I think we'll do that first. All right. Seems like it's getting a little windier. I remember there was a wolf out here, but he might, I could always retreat back to the cave. All right, I'm just gonna kind of move it because it feels like, yeah. Let's get going. This is gonna turn nasty. I need to make it to the tracks. I'm gonna grab some of this though on the way. I just want to be able to see that I'm, if I'm walking across a place that's gonna be bad ice or if it's gonna be solid ice. I need to be able to see at least 10 or 15 feet in front of my face. If the blizzard sets in, it's gonna be really hard to navigate this. Of course, right through here is not too bad. I will say that much. And there is a, yeah, there's a hunting stand right over here we're going to hit on the way as well. I think it's right on the way for the most part, so we're going to do that. Probably won't have anything worthwhile, but it's worth a look. Nope, I did that backwards. I wanted to take that. There we go. Um, I need to go this way. Can't feel my feet. I think. No, I can go this way. Yeah, I can go this way. Just gotta use these little little bits of snow right here. And we're already cold. This interloper life for us, right here. No matter what you try to do, you end up freezing. Come back with a lot, a lot more cattail heads, too. Or stocks. The wolf still over there? I don't know. But. Try not to get bit too much today. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them here. Gotta hit these. It's like five of them? Again? Yeah. Wow. Okay. Uh, where's... Where's a hunting stand? I thought it was here somewhere. Where's that? Am I on the wrong one? Must be on the wrong spot. Where's the hunting stand? Did I completely miss it? I must have missed it. Somehow. Uh, I don't think I want to go that way. Come on, buddy. Let's move. Oh, it must be further on down. I must have missed it. That's okay. Lots of cattails.
Where'd it go? I don't know how I missed it. Oh, might as well grab these. All those. 30. Wow, we have a bunch left at the house, too. Uh, I think I'll go this way. How are we doing? I'm running. Not too good. But, I mean, we're almost back to Mystery Lake, so not too bad, honestly. be happy if the uh, wind just decides to stop. Well, I bought the Hell Divers too. It looks incredible. After I get done playing this, I'm going to give it a shot. I did the tutorial. I haven't actually done a mission yet. But I'm pretty excited to give it a go. So, if you guys have played it, let me know what you guys think. I have, I have a feeling I know what the responses are going to be, but I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I feel like I'm just running in slow motion. I need to close my eyes. I'm starting to get tired, huh? That's okay. We'll be all right. We'll be ready for a nice long sleep and uh, and uh, we'll work on our recovery a little bit. We still have food in our stomachs. I guess uh, stopping and having all that bear meat was a good thing. See if we can push on through a little bit here. Dig deep. Definitely don't want to get, get bitten right now. That would be a bad, that would be a bad way to end it right there. <laughs> I wouldn't stand much of a chance. Feels like negative 14 degrees, but it doesn't matter. It's killing me at the same rate. Might as well be negative 50. All right, let's see for what we're dealing with here. Wolf wise. Wolfie's out here. Okay. Wait. There he is. He's just disappearing over there. I'm gonna try to sneak past him here. If possible. Oh shoot, he's right there. Okay, I guess we're going for it. I guess we're heading back to the uh We're heading back to uh Trapper Homestead. I just can't tangle with him right now. Don't want to waste the arrow either. Just scaring him off me. Yeah, he's too close. He's too close to the rails. Me to sneak past. I can't really waste waste time trying to play games with them either. Yeah, at least the. I wish the temperature was this nice and low back when we actually had some warmth in our body.
Of course. Need some first aid. Soon. What do you need it on? Yeah. There you go. You just gonna have to deal with the pain, brother. You're about to get some sleep anyway. I'd lay down right here if I thought I'd ever wake up again. And we're drained. So it's gonna be this pace the whole way. <laughs> we're gonna be sliding in with about 15% health. That's okay. Better than getting into a fight with that wolf. I'd rather go this way. Reco recover. Just take our time. We got food here. We got water here. We got everything we need. No risk of, uh... No risk of, uh... I could use a stem, actually, if I wanted to. If it gets too bad, I will. If I start to get dizzy, I'll use a stem. But, uh... No risk of cabin fever either. I've been outside for so uh, so much of this time. There we go. I'm uh, going to go ahead and use the stem. Give us a nice bonus there. Now we can run. So we're good. Gave us a nice health boost as well. I'm going to need to eat soon. We're already super tired, so this shouldn't really matter. And home sweet home. Made it back with a bunch of different types of wood and one extra coal. And a lot of extra cattail heads. Or cattail stalks. And it's nappy time. We'll go ahead and drink some tea as well for this particular nap. Small pieces of bear meat. That's a big one. Okay. We might do some cooking here as well. Probably do some cooking. But uh, let's go ahead and chow down here a little bit. Do we need to chow down? 382. Yeah, we do. Intentionally eat this crap. <laughs> yeah, we might just do a cook session. Might go into the cave and do it, honestly. So I can have, like, multiple fires going and knock out a lot of it. I don't know. It's not too bad to do it in here, I guess. It's not the worst. So, okay. I didn't mean to eat the whole thing, but we had, I did. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, hold on one second. I want to be able to drink my tea. There we go. We're ready to sleep. Yes, we are. Definitely ready to sleep. Time to get some HP back. There we go. There we go. Let's finish that off with some actual water. Wonderful. All right, let's get some sleep. Ten hours ought to do it. See where our health is. Oh, much better. Much better. Okay, what time is it? It's still nighttime. Probably very cold outside. I want to fumble my way here to the door. There it is. See how cold it is. 29. I kind of want to go get some wood, some more wood here. Uh, let's dive inside here again real quick. I want to drop some of this wood. If I'm going to do a big, do a big cooking session here, I want to drop all this wood that I have. Can drop these to start curing. I should have done that last night. Screwed up there. Move back a little bit here. I'll organize this a little better once it's daytime. I can see what I'm doing. There we go. 18 sticks. Move off the side a little bit for these. There we go. Okay. I got a cattail head that I don't need. I'll drop that too. Not very heavy, but okay. Let's 
go get some wood up here. There's always some good wood to be harvested up here. Cold, but make it work. Nice. Okay, let's get back inside and warm up. Okay, I think we got enough to start cooking. Plus, we got a couple pots here, too. I'm so cold, I'm warming up again. <sighs> okay, give me a couple... Let me search the ground here. Gotta be around here somewhere. Stick. Okay, a couple sticks. Um, yeah, let's get this fire going. Do we have any books that I don't want to read? Okay, nope, not really. Why didn't Failed the attempt. I'm so used to it. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking it would fail. Okay, let's try that again. Much better. Not much left on that torch. Which is left on this one. That's pretty good. I'm going to take that one. I need to probably drop the other one. Alright, let's go ahead and add some more fuel before this dies off. Good stuff. Cooking spot. Let's place our pot up here. we got two cooking pots. Let's go get ourselves the meat. From out here that we can come up. Okay, I think I'll just do bear meat. How much how big are these? Are these all huge? Yeah, they're they're pretty massive. Okay. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. Let's cook up some bear meat. That's 46, 46, 46. good. Don't need the heat from the coal. Move that coal over here. Throw another couple fir woods on here. Actually, I'll do two. There we go. Nice five-hour session. That shouldn't be too bad. Could always grab a torch out of there, too. Might do that. Let's throw my 10%er in. And then we'll grab one out. It's not a bad one. Not too bad. Looks good. Okay. Question is, do I want to try to get some going on the outside here? I could probably get a... I could do that. I could get one started here. As long as the wind isn't too bad. I'd just do it one, one log at a time. I think I'll do that. Let's do that. We get the torch out here. We're gonna light it from here. Grab another one of these. Take a cedar wood. All right. Hopefully the wind cooperates. I could start it down there in the thing, but I don't know if that's protected or not.
Let's see if we can. Come on. Are you kidding me again? There. Grab some meat here. Go straight on. Oh, Barbie. There we go. Now we got multiples. You can do this like six fires and have it cooking all kinds of meat, but as dangerous as this weather is, it makes me nervous. Cold is making my head feel thick. How are we doing over here? 15 minutes? Not too bad. Okay. Take this outside. Start a new pile. Oops. Which one's cooked? Oh, those are all the... Something's gotta go. I forgot I had more than one raw on me. I thought I was out. No, don't pick it up. It's not what I wanted. Cook that one and let's cook that one. Plenty of time left on that stove. Let's see how these are doing out here? They're probably like 35 minutes left or something. 30 minutes. Okay, good deal. Still really cold out here, even by the fire. <laughs> really cold. All right, so let's drop our cooked meat here somewhere. These look cooked, right? Yeah. Okay. These are all nasty meats. Man, if it's gonna be foggy, I might start another fire off of this. I think I'm gonna do that. Let's get a. Uh, let's get one more going here. Five three five. Good there. Yep. Uh, I can use the torch from outside. Feel pretty confident right now. Come on, tor torch, torch, torch. Bro, I want to put this thing right here. Looks like a good place. There we go. Make it happen. What? Oh, I attracted a wolf because I'm carrying all that meat. Well, he can sit and spin. He's gonna come past that fire. He's gonna yelp, run away. Turned out pretty well. I think he ran away and howled at the same time. Where you at, sucker? Looks like I survived another night. Oh, he's right there. Yeah, he's right on my doorstep. All right, I think I'm going to hang here for a minute. 20 minutes, okay. It's one way to hunt. Wolves just pick up a bunch of dead meat. food. And then wait for them to come in, wherever you're at. Uh, he must have come from, like, what is it, Max's last stand? He must have come up from all the way over there. There we go. All right, let's take a peek outside, see what it looks like. All right, I'm gonna drop some meat here. Those aren't decoys, that was my, that's my dinner. Hmm, I'm not sure where he's at now. All right, got 10 to, 10 to the meat. Oh, there's a couple ready to go. What are you talking about? Oh, that's cooked. That must be cooked. Yeah, okay. Let's drop that over here, too. Oh, embers. We don't want that. Stand by. Now 
that work? Am I too late? I uh, just have to restart it with a. Eh, it's out. Dang it. Okay. Well, I might as well add some here. There we go. All right, let me go grab some more wood. Lost track of that. We're good here. How are they doing? Yeah, uh, yeah. Half an hour till ready, so. Alright, let's try this again. Uh oh. Uh, I'm gonna hold off on that, actually. Which way is the wind blowing? Let's see here. Which way is the wind blowing? Straight up, that's good. Smoke straight up, that's good. That's not so good. Oh, hang in there, buddy. I'm gonna block you with my my body. I'm gonna help. Which way is it blowing? Yeah, it's blowing the smoke out here, so. Never felt so cold in my life. Unfortunately, I think that one's done for. Let me see, if I tuck in here, do I get... That's not good. Yeah, that one's done for. The wind's hitting it right here. Oh well. Yeah, all this cooked meat is cooked, that's good. Didn't get these done yet. I guess we're done cooking outside because it's windy. And that wind shifts, can shift all, a lot. It's a little. Partially cooked. This will be weird. Okay, I guess. Well, I'm glad it kicked up right then and I didn't waste that entire cedar. Cedar log. Oh well. Is what it is. All right, we're re restocking our supplies here. Yeah, that's that's good. That's good. Checking my times there. Yeah, we're doing all right. We're doing okay. Let's just focus on this right here then. Never been so hungry in my life. Okay, let's run that outside. Grab a couple more pieces. Try not to attract any wolves. All right. I think I'll put that cedar log in here. I thought I had cedar. Maybe it was, oh, it was sticks. There we go. Not bad. Keep it going. Could run out here and get... Chop up another limb right there. Might do that. I know it's going to take... Right. It's going to take 56, 58 minutes. Our cook time's 46. 44 to 46 on those. It's probably down to about 40 now by the time it, I run out here. So, that's still, they won't burn. But, I'm gonna do this. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, this takes a little longer. That's okay. I just want that. 
I want to be able to cook a lot more of this meat. I think I had raw meat on me when I was doing all that. <laughs> all right. There we go. Let's grab this. Grab that. Cook another couple. Moldy and rancid. There we go. I need something to eat. Oh, now you're going to play nice. Hey, weather. Uh, I guess I could have just looked up there. Uh, should I do it? I say yes. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Feels like negative nineteen, huh? Oh. All right, let's give it another shot here. I got a couple pieces of wood on me right now, but might as well pick up what we got here. There we go. Got some reclaimed wood and some coal if I need to merge this fire here, I guess. Alright, let's try it again. Let's try to get these two fires going. Okay, should be uh, leveling up my fire starting skill with all this. Double check. Still looks pretty good. Let's give it a shot. I don't like the chances on the. I should have used a stick. I don't know why I didn't use a stick. I used fir wood. It's 20% lower chance to start Come the fire. On. Yeah. That was sort of silly. There we go. Let's try this. Can't feel my hands. That did there it. There we go. I don't have anything to place on there. Stand by. Throw this on there real quick. Just get it going. There we go. Oh, I need I need to add a wood. <laughs> Five minutes. That ain't gonna cut it. Fire starting skill is at now. Come on, come on. Man, that that little windstorm just came through. It was just enough to blow out the fires and then just disappeared. It worked. Alright, let's get some more shrimps on the Barbie. I'm gonna throw this thing, I think. It won't let me. Ah. I guess when it's not lit, it won't let you. That was 900. Take that and that. Those two. Perfect. Great. Two. Cooking. Okay. All right, we're back to cooking six at a time. All right, which one's the lowest? I think it's a 28 minute one is. Yeah, it's been advanced time for this one. No, I got a little cold there, but that's okay. Not cold enough to hurt me though. Am I, am I close enough to the other fire that it's actually, oh yeah, it's barely, because I have multiple fires going.
Okay, now we got a little system going here. The next one will be inside the house. Hour seven, hour two. I can't go out and harvest any more wood. <laughs> My health can't <laughs> take it. So, that's okay. We're, we'll sleep good tonight, recover a lot of our condition, but we've got a lot of meat cooked now. So, we went from having not much left to now having this all cooked up, so that's good. Let's grab another couple here. Resupply. Plus, we have a lot of water, too. Okay, very good. Very good. I'm not going to use up the emergency reclaimed wood or the coal just for this little cooking session. Not worth it. Save that for emergency. Go back to this one. That'll be 37. This will be higher. Yep. So, 55 on that tire. I think this might be our last batch here. Yeah, 37. We might be able to get another one. We'll try it. Real quick about it. Might add a couple sticks if I have any. I don't know if I have any more. 36. 56, yeah. What do I got? That should do it. Maybe one more. One more stick. I got some fur woods here I could keep going with. If the weather's good, I might as well, right? I got three. I could, I could extend each one of these fires. Yeah, I'm going to extend each one of these fires, the fir wood. That's what it's there for. Uh, did I pull it off too early? I think I pulled it off too early. Should finish cooking, though. I don't think it, it's like water where you have to restart from it. Oh, you got to start it all over. Okay. My bad. My bad. That's okay. See how things are, things are going in here. Looking good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and throw another fur wood in there. Two more hours worth of cooking time. We'll be nice and tired after all this. A busy day cooking. Look at that. We've really almost got rid of all that bear meat. That's crazy. I need one more over here, don't I? Nope. Okay. Really don't want to get out of sink messes it up. It just becomes more annoying than it needs to be. Okay, we're good there. Alright, back out to the front here. Or to the side. 32 minutes until ready. 32, and I think these are in the 40s. Yeah. Okay. Do need more Need another firewood here. Actually, I'm gonna time lapse this in case the wind hits. Okay, I think we're good for another piece of wood. Oh, stand by. Do I have it? Do I have some with me? No, that's the cooked meat, isn't it? Rancid, rancid. Okay, doesn't matter. Cool. Okay. Uh oh. And that's it. Piece of meat here. Here we go. I think we're good. Two hours, hour 38, and then like two hours in there too. Oh, it's so nice to have 
level 5 cooking skill and I can survive off of a bear. Alright, so this one will this one will go out first, I think. And then it's you outside. So we'll put these up here. Alright, let's go check on the other ones. Should be close. 35. Two. Not really. Not sure why I feel so tired. Starting to blow a little bit. Timing might be good on this. I dropped one, I think that was. Cook, cook. cook. Nope, that one. Yep, okay. I don't want to be mixing the meats in together. It's dangerous. Okay, please hold off wind. Please hold off. Just 56 minutes. Gotta wait for it, rather than just grab it. What I was doing before jumping the gun. Oh, well, here it comes again. Another windstorm. But I think we're gonna be okay for the most part. Might. Yeah, we might be okay. We got a lot done. A lot of cooking done. You should be done, right? Yes, they are. I don't think I have any more on me. I can cook. Yeah. Got rid of them all. The door's getting a workout. Uh-oh. Okay. I do want to actually use one of these. I didn't realize that. that. was that close. We'll see if it... If these cook fast enough to overcome that. I think they will. I think the numbers are a little off because my skill level is so high. And I actually get a little bit of a bonus there. Cooking times. That are what are shown. 37 until ready. 42. Oh, yeah. Back on track. Oh, yeah. Just blowing out, too. Perfect. And wait, you're getting blown out, too? No. Five minutes until ready. Come on. Made it. What about you? Come on, baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just in time. Alright, that looks good. Oh, gotta move that one. Going through looking for any that don't have cooked after it. Okay, I think we're good. Nice. Let's get inside to see what we got going on in here. Did we make it? Did we? Cooking paused. How far along are we? I wanna leave it there. I want to leave it there, because I think when you start up, it, it, if you take it off, I think it resets the time. I think if you leave it in there, it'll just pick up from where it was was at. So we got, we got quite a bit done. Pretty happy with that. And we're nice and tired. And we could use a good rest. Our health could definitely use a good rest. So we're hungry. Definitely no shortage of food here. So, all right. What are these? Can I eat these? Oh, yeah. Let's eat some rancid wolf meat. It's cooked, so let's eat it. <clears throat> yeah, this tiny little piece, huh? Is this bigger? 
Not by much. Alright, let's try to do better than that. Let's have a better dinner than that. There we go. Okay, much better. Let's get a drink. Get some sleep. Check and see what my timer's at here. Oh, we're just over an hour. Good timing. Good timing. Alright, so we're... Got food, everything. I think we're ready to get some rest. Let's see where we're at after 10 hours here. Again, no, no tea this time. So we're not going to be turbocharged with our healing. Probably be about 50%, I'd have to guess. 45, 50%. Oh, that's a pleasant surprise. It's more like 60. And I'll take it. We're going to need to grab some more water. Start the next episode. Alright guys, so let me uh, go ahead and step out, step back in. We'll see what it looks like outside. Oh yeah. Looks kind of terrifying, honestly. Head back inside. See. And uh, thanks guys for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Oh, hold on one second. Before we do that. Before you guys all take care. Let's see here. Five, five, five. Fire starting three. So, oh, we're advancing three. They're pretty good. So not too bad. All right. Now, y'all take care.